What's up everybody, it's your boy Top Cat Wallace playing Ark Survival Evolved on the PS4. Yeah, so we just out here today looking for a quest to spawn uh, over here by the green obelisk, but I mean, it's, you see it's dead out here, man. I mean, it's slim pickings, man. I think we're going to call it a day. We've been out here for a while. Hmm. What's this crawling around down here? Oh, just grab that. Let's see what that is. I'm going to use a Pego Max or something. Wait a minute. Oh, yes. It's an otter. Oh, man. That's great. That's good news. <laughs> it just turned like a bad day into a good day. I mean, these little guys are great to have, man. They're hard to find because they die immediately, I would imagine. And, uh, you know, they're great for when you go into the snow, into the cold. If you don't have fur armor, you know, you wrap this little guy around your neck and you stay warm. So that just... That's sweet. I got one already, but I got three bases and one otter, so I'll be, you know, having to share. <laughs> I got two otters, man, and if it's a boy, man, that's even better. I have a boy and a girl. All right. I got this research facility here. We're going to drop them off and, uh, you know, get some stamina, and then we'll take them back to Herb Island, and we, we'll set up a little taming pen for them. Mm -hmm. All right. That's good. I seen him. He dropped in there. Oh, good job, buddy. You did your thing. Oh, what a find. I'm so happy. All right, let's just make sure he can't get out or clip off or nothing. All right, I ain't going to open the doors. I know he's standing right next to it. <laughs> oh, man, that was sweet, man. I feel so much better about myself. Uh, let's hang out, get some stamina, and then we're going to make the long ride home, buddy. Uh, new member to the tribe, right, Mango? Yeah, man, that's a sweet thing, man. I remember when you joined the tribe, man. It was like, uh, seems like just the other day, man. I found you, man, like the same circumstances. Just on my way home, you know, doing my... Yeah, so ain't nothing out here today, Crimson. I guess we gonna, we gonna call it a day, man. Let's get on home. All right, I see a bird stuck in the rock down here. It's probably Tyrannodon, you know. Sometimes I like to free the birds, man, you know. It makes me feel good about myself, you know, and uh, you know, like I did something nice for the world. Let's go get him out of here. Wait a minute. That's not a Tyrannodon. Oh, it's another type of horror. Oh, this is great. This is a great day indeed. Because these guys, I mean, they are very hard to catch, man. If you just come near them, man, they take off so fast, man, and it's so hard to catch them. You know, so this is great right here, man. I mean, he might be low level or something, but at this point, I don't care what he is. I mean, he's like, this is like easy pickings right here, man. Let's get a good look at him, man, if we can. Oh, look at that, man. He's the bomb, man. He's got orange and green, man. Oh, this dude is nice, man. I think I want to save him, man. Let's just look in the area. Oh, boy. All right, let's go home and get some narcotics. And then we come back and, uh, you know, we knock him out. And uh, we get him some prime meat, man, and feed him, man. You know, I think that'll be a good plan. You know, a second thought? Let's go back and knock him out now. That way, you know, when we get back, because we a couple of islands over. I got a base in Weathertop. But um, we knock him out now. By the time we get back, you know, he'll be nice and hungry. Make the team go super fast. All right, I got a Therinosaur standing right there, yo. So I got to do this quick. <laughs> There he is, he's right next to us. Oh man, let's hurry up. One in the butt. All right, I hear him snoring, that's it. <laughs> he's down. All right, let's get out of here, man. Cause this is not, you know, I thought it was gonna be easy, but it seems like it ain't. Cause, you know, the stemming is all, man. They real sneaky, man. They act like they just hanging out. You know, they're herbivores, but you know, they kind of psycho, man. Cause if you just, you know, they could be standing there just picking flowers and the next minute they, they killing everybody in your crew. So, you know, I done died enough to these dudes, man. I mean, I walked up on these dudes and just, it's like instant death. You might as well don't even fight back, man. And I mean, he's standing right here by the team. It's gonna kinda, mm, it's gonna kinda compromise what we trying to do here. I do want to get the bird, but I think we gonna have to kill this dude to get him, man. Look at him. He look at you, then he turn his head like he ain't looking, then he look at you. <laughs> yeah, I ain't falling for that, buddy. You know what? I'm going back to get Scarlet, yo. All right, we back at the base at Weathertop. It took me quite a while to get here, man, so I hope the dude is still there when we get back, man. But uh, I got my RG here, Scarlet, man, and I'd rather have her out there, you know, just in case things go south, you know. You know, she'll do her thing, man. Uh, you know, Crimson, he ain't no fighter, man. He's more of a scout, man, you know. All right, we want to take out the tranquilizer darts, and we want to put in the real bullets now. <laughs> 
you know, just in case, you know, things go sour, man. You know, hey. All right, Crimson, you did your thing, man. You hang out here for a minute. I'll be right back. All right, let's grab some, uh, go grab some of this cooked prime meat, man. You know, the cooked prime is good as an alternative because sometimes when you're taming something, ain't no raw, you know, ain't no prime meat to be found, you know, sometimes. So, you know, I mean, you ain't going to get the best tame, but at least we got something, you know. All right, let's throw this on the bird and get out of here. Let me see, I got narcotics. Mm, I think I'm good on water. All right. So we saw a Carnotaur on the way back over, man, and I figured I'd get some prime meat off him. I just wanted to lure him away because his raptor's following him, and it's like, you know, and these bugs are coming. Oh my goodness, yo. It's very busy out here today. <laughs> All right, we got to level up. Let's level up uh, health. All right, you ready, girl? Yeah, she ready. All right, let's get it on. Money, I need that meat. All right, he's down. Level four. That didn't take long at all. Hopefully, we get some prime off this dude, man, and you know, we can feed it to the bird. Hmm, looks like I got, I got about two primes off him that time. That's pretty good. All right, let's get back, man. I know this dude is either starving or dead or both. <laughs> oh my goodness. All right, now I know it's along this river somewhere, and uh, trying to figure out what is that down there. Oh, all right, it's not bird. It's one of these little uh, clearings on this river here. It's either that one or this one. Okay, I see the Therinosaur. He's still there. Yeah, all right. Yeah, he's still there. We gonna have to take him out. I see. All right, how we doing on health? We eat a little meat and get her fed. All right, let's go. It look like he on the beach now. Maybe he won't come by. Maybe we won't have to kill him, but... You know, I think I'm gonna kill him anyway, man. I'm just... You know, you can't turn your back on this dude. See? He's... Look at him. He's just... So for some reason, he's coming this way now. You know, it's the worst. All right, he's still knocked out. I can hear him snoring. <laughs> Sleeping like a baby. I mean, I can't see him, man. I think he's totally in the rock now, so... We're gonna have to destroy this whole rock, and I hope I don't kill him in the process. You know, we're going to get a little stamina back, then we're going to set off the melee. All right, let's do this. Uh, excuse me, sir. Can I have a word with you for a second? <laughs> you know? Nice. If I can lead him into this water, man. Oh, man, another Therminosaur is on the other side. I was going to try to lead him into the water with the piranhas. Maybe the piranhas will help me out, but I don't want to get close to that other Therminosaur. So we're gonna have to take it here. We have to keep it on this beach. Yeah, he pissed off now. Yeah, that dude is right there. We have two of them. Oh man, I think I hit the Triceratops by mistake. Oh, now I got two dinosaurs pissed off at me. Ish. Alright, well, let's do what we gotta do. We got a few hits on him on that one. Oh, oh man oh he got some reach man I mean he hit me from all the way up here yeah money this is what it is right now it's on man look at the size of that look at the size of that fish man goodness gracious piranha's huge oh he's trying to walk away now there ain't no walking away my man come here alright he's down I gotta get that roar, I gotta get that prime meat off him, but this uh this trike is mad at me. Sorry about this money. You just was a casualty of the war. Let's get that meat. Oh man, the dang mosquitoes done ate the meat before I can get to it. Oh, oh man, I done hit the iguana. Oh no. Oh no, this is this is going really bad. I got the mosquitoes mad at me. I got the iguana mad at me. This is not this is not going well. Get them out of here, man. I mean, those things will those things will eat your body so fast. I mean, they ate them up before I could get back to them. And now I got this iguana don mad at me. You know, these guys are great, man. I got five iguana dons, man. They I love these animals, but he's kind of pissed off at me right now. <laughs> I don't want to kill him, man. You know, because I like him so much, but you know, 
when they walk on their hind legs with their hands up like that, man, that, that mean they trying to hurt you. So, you know, and I know this from, from hanging out with my boys. How we doing over here? Yeah, he's still breathing. He's still sleeping. I don't know how long I got, but, uh, you know, we might just trank him again, you know, and see how it goes. All right, buddy, we sorry. We sorry. We apologize for hitting you, man. It was the heat of the battle, and, you know, let's let bygones be bygones, man. You know, ain't no reason to escalate this. I mean, you've seen what happened just now. You know what you're dealing with. Oh, man, take this time. He can't get up this rock. Maybe I'll take this time to get Scarla up, man. Maybe he'll forget about things. All right, good. Looks like he going away. All right, he's calm. He's cool. I'm calm, submissive state. <laughs> Back to the rescue. You know? Oh, wait a minute now. Okay, okay. He 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 ain't forgetting. We gonna have to take him out. Sorry, buddy. Oh, I hated to do that to him, man. Such a nice color too, man. Is that Dimorphodon the same color scheme as my bird? Oh man, that's nice. Check it out. Yeah, I gotta get him, man. <laughs> I come back looking for him. Oh, the mosquitoes. You know, once something dies, it, they feel that it's theirs. And if you try to eat the meat around the mosquitoes, uh, they coming to kill you, man. I mean, those mosquitoes, they are dragonflies, actually. And they just, they ruthless, man. All right. Uh, he's still breathing. <laughs> Thanks a lot, Scarlet. I mean. Get out of that rock, you stupid bird. Causing me all this drama. Did that do it? Oh, no. I think he's still in there, man. Oh, we got to get him out. Don't worry, buddy. We're gonna get you out. Oh yeah, he's still there. We'll get you. Hope I'm not hurting him, man. Goodness gracious. Ow. <laughs> Big old rock outside my head, man. <laughs> uh, Titanosaur right there. Good. Maybe that'll keep the predators away. All right, Scala. Uh, Scala? I need that meat, girl. What you up there doing, man? You the <laughs> she up there defying the laws of physics right now, man. Get your butt down here. I got to get that prime meat off you, man. Oh, boy. All right, well, let me move over here a little bit. Maybe, uh, okay. Here she comes. All right. Oh, man, what a day, man. Trying to do something nice. Turn into a big fiasco. <laughs> oh, come on, man. Get the dang tree out the way, man. Come on. Yeah, it's tight over here in the jungle, man. It ain't no joke, man. All right, good. This is a good spot. All right. Let's see how we doing here. Oh, yeah, yeah. He's doing good. Oh, man. He's starving, man. Oh, this is going to be a quick tame. He's starving. He's going to eat all his food in one drop, and he's going to be ours. He's such a low level. Uh, hello? Oh, man. I'm caught on his hitbox. Crap. I can't get out. What is that? Oh, man. Yeesh. Let's get out of here. Let's get out of here. Ah, oh, <laughs> I kind of pooped in and the poop, the poop lifted me up off him, man. That's great, man. The poop will come in handy one day. I knew it. All right, we got like three pieces of prime and some cooked prime. We're going to be good. This ain't going to take but a minute. Let's throw this on him. Oh, yeah, he ate that immediately. Oh, he's hungry. Look at him. All right, we got him. We got him. He's up and at him. He's, he's beat up really bad, man. His health is low, but we're going to get him home, man. Uh, I ain't got no name for you right now. I name you. I'm going to just name you Hugh, as in color, because you're so pretty. And uh, we'll name you when we get home. Uh, Scala, let's get out of here, man. I done had enough of this place, man. For the mosquitoes come back. Oh, man. That was great, man. Finally. Oh, there he is. Oh, look at him. Yeah, I know you feel good, buddy. Finally getting able to fly. Oh, yeah. We're going to take you home, get you a saddle, man. We're going to teach you the ways of the force, man. Welcome to the tribe, buddy. Check him out. <laughs> nice. Let's get home, man. Yeah, so that was a great day, man. Um, let's get this otter home, man. Tame him up, man. And uh, welcome him into the tribe, man.